in exercise 9.4 we will perform binomial binomial multiplied by binomial so let me show you how do we multiply binomial with binomial let us take, take example a plus b is to be multiplied with say c plus d right so there are uh, two three different methods one method the most common method is uh, by putting all terms in multiplication so how do we multiply all terms with each other so take a first a and multiply it with c plus d and again take b b then multiply it with again c plus d so you will be having a c plus a d and plus b c plus b d so this is one of the method another method is a plus b uh, right below as c plus d and then start multiplying it uh, with the help of the vedic mathematics you remember uh, first of all downside multiplication b into b b into d that is bd put plus sign then cross multiplication and addition so this is ad ad plus bc and uh, this is called cross multiplication and then downward multiplication again a into c that is plus sign ac so this is another method <coughs> so terms are uh, terms can be written anywhere there is no problem with it so ac can be written very at the very first or ac can be written somewhere in the middle or in the last so there is no problem with it so there is another method very very technical method technical kind of thing this is called foil method f o i l foil method so what do we do f f stands for first term with the first term multiplication o means outside terms i means inside terms and uh, l stands for last last terms so, so when i say first term with first term so this is first term of the first polynomial and the first term of the first polynomial so these are to be multiplied plus only plus we have then o mane o means o outside terms so outside terms are a and d a and d so multiply a and d then plus then uh, i stands for inner side inner side inner side inner side these are two inner side terms b and c b and c are inner side terms so we have bc and plus l means in the binomial last term last term and last term so this is bd so this is another method of doing multiplication exercise 9.4 question number 1 multiply the binomials multiply the binomials multiply the binomials so the first question is first is 2x plus 5 and 2x plus 5 and 4x minus 3 so as i told you this is a binomial into binomial to be done with the help of uh, distributive property uh, distribution property distribution of uh, the first polynomial or the second polynomial and uh, how do we do this this is 2x plus 5 and 4x minus 3 so write them without any sign between in them uh, here we have a multiplication sign right so we have two compound two two binomials and multiplication sign between them so without multiplication it is understood that uh, these are in the product format right so now uh there is a simple method say this is 2x is to be multiplied with 4x minus 3 and plus 5 likhenge or 4x minus 3 se multiply fir se karenge 
नोट इट डाउन ये दो बार नहीं लिखा है बल्कि डिस्ट्रीब्यूटिव प्रॉपर्टी जैसे कि आपने पहले भी पढ़ा है ए इंटू बी प्लस सी होता है जैसे तो ए दो बार आता है ना ए इंटू बी और ए इंटू सी सिमिलरली ए प्लस बी इंटू सी प्लस डी में भी ए प्ल ए के साथ सी प्लस डी आएगा और बी के साथ भी सी प्लस डी आएगा राइट सो ये वाला फॉर्मेट इसको दो बार ना समझ के आप यूँ समझिए कि जब इसका कॉमन लेना होगा तो सी प्लस डी का कॉमन आ जाएगा और ए प्लस बी बीच में बच जाएगा तो एक ही चीज़ है ये कम्यूनिटी प्रॉपर्टी की वजह से आगे पीछे सो so, ये वाला दोनों तरफ कॉमन हुआ एक तरह से नाव मल्टीप्लाइंग फोर टू ज़ा एट एक्स इंटू एक्स एक्स स्क्वायर ईजी है ये हम कर चुके हैं पहले भी थ्री टू ज़ा सिक्स एक्स प्लस फाइव प्लस नो 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 दिस इज़ फाइव इंटू फोर ट्वेंटी इंटू एक्स माइनस फाइव थ्री ज़ा सो फिफ्टीन सो दिस इज़ हाउ वी डू दिस नाउ लाइक टर्म्स देखिए दीज टू आर लाइक टर्म्स सो दिस इज एट एक्स स्क्वायर एंड सिक्स एक्स प्लस ट्वेंटी एक्स माइनस सिक्स एक्स है सो दिस इज प्लस फोर्टीन ऑफ एक्स माइनस फिफ्टीन एंड दिस इज योर आंसर ऑल टर्म्स आर अनलाइक टर्म्स सो दिस वन इज द आंसर सेकेंड पार्ट करके देखते हैं सो वाई माइनस एट लिखेंगे एंड इन टू लिखेंगे थ्री वाई माइनस फोर सो ब्रैकेट्स क्लोज और स्टार्ट इमीजिएटली हो तो इसको इन टू समझना है राइट सो वट वी हैव हेयर इज मल्टीप्लीकेशन साइन सो द नेक्स्ट स्टेप इज वाई इन टू थ्री वाई माइनस फोर माइनस एट लिखेंगे अगेन थ्री वाई माइनस फोर लिखेंगे दैन डिस्ट्रीब्यूटिव प्रॉपर्टी से अंदर मल्टीप्लाई हो जाएगा थ्री वाई इंटू वाई इज थ्री वाई स्क्वायर माइनस फोर वाई माइनस फाइव थ्री एट थ्री जो ट्वेंटी फोर वाई माइनस माइनस प्लस नोट इट डाउन ये माइनस और ये माइनस मल्टीप्लीकेशन में होंगे तो प्लस होगा एट फोर जो थर्टी टू सो दीज टू आर लाइक टर्म्स एंड वी हैव थ्री वाई स्क्वायर माइनस ट्वेंटी एट which is your answer next is third one 2.5 l minus 0.5 m and uh, 2.5 l plus 0.5 m so start karte hain 2.5 l minus 0.5 m into 2.5 l plus 0.5 m so when we start it distribute first 0.5 l 2.5 l into 2.5 l plus 0.5 m and minus sign 0.5 m bracket start ye wala component and then this is 2.5 l plus 0.5 m सो डिस्ट्रीब्यूट करते हैं 2.5 पॉइंट फाइव इंटू टू पॉइंट फाइव इज बेसिकली सो वॉट इट शुड बी टू पॉइंट फाइव इंटू टू पॉइंट फाइव इज सिक्स पॉइंट टू फाइव एल स्क्वायर राइट मल्टीप्लीकेशन है सो दिस इज प्लस टू पॉइंट फाइव इंटू जीरो पॉइंट फाइव सो वट वी नीड टू डू टू पॉइंट फाइव जीरो पॉइंट फाइव सो दिस इज़ वन टू फाइव काउंट करिए वन टू डेसीमल काउंट किया so this is 1.25 lm similarly minus 0.5 into 2.5 is 1.25 l and m lm so negative sign again minus plus minus is 0.5 into 0.5 is 0.25 right 0.25 make sure डेसिमल मल्टीप्लीकेशन है सिंपल है इजी है ऐसा कोई इशू नहीं है सो दीज टू आर लाइक टर्म्स एंड आर सेम सो योर आंसर इज 6.25 पॉइंट टू फाइव एल स्क्वायर माइनस जीरो पॉइंट टू फाइव एम स्क्वायर ऑल अदर सब पार्ट्स आर इजी सो द फिफ्थ वन इज फिफ्थ वन फिफ्थ वन कर देता हूँ आपके लिए एक बार द फिफ्थ वन इज थ्री अपॉइंट फोर थ्री अपॉइंट फोर a square uh, no this is this is not a fifth one but sixth sixth part of question number 1 3 upon 4 a square plus 
थ्री बी स्क्वायर इन टू करना है फोर फोर भी है फोर वी हैव फोर हेयर फोर इन टू फोर इन टू ए स्क्वायर माइनस टू बाई थ्री बी स्क्वायर सो नो नीड टू वरी अबाउट दिस फोर सो देर इज अ ब्रैकेट क्लोज एंड मल्टीप्लीकेशन साइन से हेयर इज अ मल्टीप्लीकेशन साइन अगेन मल्टीप्लीकेशन साइन सो दिस फोर दिस फोर इन बिटवीन कैन बी टेकन आउट टेकन आउट एट हेयर सो वाई दिस इज ए इन टू फोर इन टू बी कैन बी री रिटर्न एज फोर इन टू ए इन टू बी नो प्रॉब्लम सो लाइक वाइज वी कैन री राइट इट एज फोर ब्रैकेट स्टार्ट थ्री बाई फोर ए स्क्वायर प्लस थ्री बी स्क्वायर ब्रैकेट क्लोज ब्रैकेट स्टार्ट अगेन ए स्क्वायर माइनस टू अपॉन थ्री बी स्क्वायर सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल पुट दिस फोर इन साइड एनी ऑफ द टू एनी ऑफ द टू मीन्स डोंट एंटर दिस फोर इन टू बोथ ऑफ द बाइनोमियल्स सी वेन वी हैव फोर इन टू ए इन टू बी सो इधर यू कैन से दिस इज फोर ए इन टू बी राइट फोर ए इन टू बी दिस इज नॉट लाइक फोर ए इन टू फोर बी दिस इज रॉन्ग दिस इज रॉन्ग सो वैन वी हैव ऑल थ्री कॉम्पोनेंट्स इन मल्टीप्लीकेशन ओनली टू कॉम्पोनेंट्स विल मल्टीप्लाई सो थर्ड विल रिमेन एज इट इज सो सिमिलर इन द सिमिलर वे दिस कॉम्पोनेंट विल टेक अप फोर और दिस विल टेक अप फोर एनी ऑफ द टू विल टेक अप फोर सो वट आई एम डूइंग हेयर इज putting this 4 inside this uh, first binomial and you will be getting 4 4 cancel out this is 3 a square plus 4 will again enter here because this is binomial 4 into 3 that is 12 b square now bracket close and this is a square minus 2 upon 3 b square so this is the step which is very very important now again simple thing distributive property use kariye uh take this one 3a square and uh, multiply with these two terms of the second binomial so 3a square into a square is 3 a raised to power 4 you can you can do this without writing this particular this one line you can straight away directly multiply the first term with the whole of the binomial then second term with the whole of the second binomial so this is 3a square into a square is 3 into a, a4 3a square minus 2 upon 3 that is 3 and 3 will cancel out minus will reduce as 3 uh, no 3 but this is 2 3 and 3 cancel out 2 we have a square and b square a square and b square then plus plus 12 b square into a square this is 12 a square b square so no need to worry about 12 a square b square or you can write 12 b square a square so these two are same things no need to worry about so this is 12 a 12 b square a square this is 12 a square b square and now plus 12 minus 2 by 3 so this is plus 12 multiply minus 2 by 3 So three will cancel out four. Twelve will give you. It will give you four here. Four into minus two. That is minus of eight. B square. B square will give you b raised to power four. So now these two terms are. Question number two. Find the product. Again the same question we have. Binomial into binomial. Five minus two x into into. 3 plus x. So how we do, do we do this? 5, write 5, and is multiplied by 3 plus x, and minus 2 x into 3 plus x. So one thing, make sure one thing that uh, you can break any of the any of the two polynomials. You can write here as no problem. You can write here as 3 bracket start 5 minus 2 x plus x. Bracket start five minus two x. There is no problem at all, right? So whatever you will do, it will be correct. So you either you break the second one or you break the first one. So mostly I am breaking the first one and uh, using the bin uh, the distributive property here. So distribute this five into the binomial again. Monomial and binomial we have done already. So this is five into three fifteen. 
plus 5 into x is 5x minus 2 into 3 6x right 6x make sure this is minus 2 into x this is minus uh, 2x square note it down this is negative sign because of this negative sign multiplied by a positive sign minus multiply plus is always minus so this is your answer these two these two are similar the like terms so this is 15 minus 5x minus 6 is minus 1x say you know 1x minus 2x square minus 2x square even if you are not putting this minus so this is minus x so similarly if you have if you have taken this uh, the first term here the first uh, binomial here and you have uh, break uh, you have broken this uh, the second polynomial then you will have the same answer look at it this is 5 into 3 15 minus 3 into 2 6 x plus 5 into x plus and minus minus 2 x square so you will have the same answer 15 so these two minus x minus 2 x square no problem at all the both areas the both types will give you the same answers there is no problem in it so this is your question number two uh, part karta hon iska. Uh, see question number kar deta hon. Uh, see this is fourth part kar deta hon iska ek bar se. this is p square p square minus q square into 2p 2p plus q 2p plus q so both p are same thing yeah? so here we have p square bracket start वैसे ही करना है जैसे बताया minus q square bracket start 2p plus q so you will be getting distribute करिए p square into 2p that is 2p cube plus p square q minus 2p q square minus q cube right why 2 and 1 power so this is equal to this is equal to i think here is p square p square and here is q square so these two are unlike terms here right these two are unlike terms q cube and p cube are, are again unlike terms so all these terms are unlike terms and this is your answer when you have unlike terms all unlike terms in a question you cannot do anything with it so this will be your part number four question number two exercise 9.2 again by taking binomial into binomial in question number three exercise 9.4 the first component is simplify we have to simplify simplify what is the question simplify this is your question x square minus 5 bracket into x plus 5 and plus 5 plus 25 as the third term we have these two binomials are in multiplication and this is in addition here so solution part dekhte hai. solution we have this is uh, this 25 will remain as it is unless all these two binomial terms are being multiplied with each other so what we have to do here is simply focus multiplying these two and start it by x square bracket start x plus 5 as we done we have done in the previous question minus 5 and x plus 5 <coughs> plus 25 right so this will be equal to x raised to power 3 plus x raised to power 2 into x raised to power 1 and 5 into x square is 5x square minus 5 into x is 5x minus 5 plus 5 multiplication so this is minus 25 right minus 5 plus 5 is minus 25 plus 25 is the last term we have this one right here so this is equal to minus 25 and plus 25 are cancelled so your answer is x raised to power 3 plus 5 x square minus 5 x so all terms are 
unlike terms and this is your answer let us start doing part number two question number three part number two says a square plus five into b cube plus three plus five so by doing the binomial into binomial and putting this five as it is we will be having a square into b cube plus three plus five into b cube plus three again plus five so the next line is distribute this a square into the binomial so multiplying it a square into b cube is a square b cube plus 3 into a square is 3a square plus 5 into b cube is 5b cube plus 5 into 3 is 15 plus 5 so these two are to be added b cube no b cube a square no a square a square a, a square b cube no a square b square another one so this is your answer a square b cube plus 3 a square plus 5 b cube plus 20 it's your final answer part number two is similar to part number three is similar to the part number one and part number two so i'm doing part number four here question number three so we have uh, three binomial into binomial formats so no need to worry about it do this one perform this one and uh, enter this two inside uh, you will be getting a uh, large number of uh, polynomial having many terms and all like terms will be clubbed together and uh, you will be getting the final answer a simple thing uh, just perform the first one as we have done previously a into c minus d plus b into again c minus d plus plus so this one is first part first binomial into binomial the second one is pick a and uh, write it as a into c plus d minus b into c plus d again and this is two uh, enter this two this is two ac two ac plus two bd simple so the next line is next is a into c ac minus a into d ad plus b into c bc minus 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 and plus minus minus bd a into c plus sign ac a into d plus sign ad minus b into c minus of bc minus of bd plus of twice of ac plus 2 bd so we have many terms here the next line is find out ac another ac the here is we have two ac <coughs> and another ac we have so ac plus ac plus 2 ac is basically 4 ac note it down ac plus ac plus 2 ac we will be having 4 ac that's all this is 1 AC, this is 1 AC and this is 2 AC. So 4 AC. The second component is AD. Uh, AD. AD, find out another AD. AD, AD, AD. We have AD. Minus AD and plus AD is gone. If we have another AD, then find it out. No AD else. So AD is gone. Then third term is BC. Find out another BC. This is BC plus and BC minus. BC is gone find out for another bc no bc another is we have uh, in whole of the polynomial so find out for bd this is negative of bd negative of bd again negative of bd so negative of bd negative of bd again negative of bd <coughs> and we have plus 2 bd plus 2 bd so what do we do these two negative signs minus 1 minus 1 so this is minus 2 bd plus 2 bd so all in all we have zero so no bd we have 
finally so your answer simple this is your answer so all terms are gone so this is your final answer now part number 5 and part number 6 are same things as part number 7 so i am performing here part number 7 for you so if you have any problem in part number 5 or 6 you can take the idea from part number 7 we have binomial and trinomial multiplication here so this is the same thing uh, we are doing previously as binomial and binomial so in the solution you will write 1.5 x into again you will write the second polynomial as a whole plus 3 and the first binomial is broken out minus 4 into y bracket start 1.5x plus 4y plus 3 minus 4.5x plus 12y so this is your distribution property starting here 1.5x and 1.5x is 2.2.25x square right 1.5 into 1.5 is 2.25 confirm it by multiplication x we have here x we have here so x into x is x square we have so this is plus 4 into 1.5 15 4 the 60 this is 6.0 xy plus 15 into 3 is 4.5 4.5 and put x here this is negative sign again 1.5 into 4 is 6.0 uh xy you can write x and y xy uh, plus and minus will give you minus minus 4 into 4 is 16 16 y into y will give you y square minus 4 plus 3 that is minus 12 y minus 4.5x plus 12y so this is your a bit lengthy but uh, uh, find out for x square variable another one x square variable any one no one so this is 2.25 x square xy find out another xy this is xy again we have xy here xy here so only xy with two terms 6.0 and 6.0 with negative sign both will cut each other 4.5x and negative of 4.5x will cut again each other so finally we have 16y square no 16y square no one with y square again 16y square and 16y square is gone now 12y no one with by y so this is minus of 12y and find out for another one no 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 this is minus 12y and plus 12y so you will be having Minus 12y and plus 12y will cut each other and uh, no answer zero. So this is your final answer. Answer, right? This is your part number seven, question number three, exercise 9.4. Last question, eighth part, exercise 9.4, question number three, last part we have trinomial into trinomial. The pattern will be same. So all terms will multiply with each other. So in order to perform this, first take up a, multiply it, write it with the second in multiplication with the second polynomial a plus b minus c. Look at it. The second polynomial, second second trinomial is written uh, to be multiplied with a a, then b part b component will be multiplied with a plus b minus c second polynomial. then third term c of the first polynomial will be multiplied with a plus b minus c second polynomial so this is called a distribution of all the terms with each other so firstly we have written here and then distribute all the terms inside with each other so a into a this is a square a into b plus b no 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 this is plus ab a into c with negative sign this is minus ac plus b into a that is ab again uh, b into b this is b square b into minus c is minus bc 
minus c into a minus c a you can write or you can write minus a c no problem with it no problem with it you can write minus a c minus c into b this is negative sign b c minus c into minus c this is positive sign c square make sure negative sign and negative sign will multiply will give you plus sign c square c into c is a c square so find out for uh, like terms a square a square with anybody other no one a b with anybody other a b a b a b a b positive sign a b positive sign so we have two a b two a b right so minus of a c and negative of a c again so minus of a c minus of a c minus of a c minus of a c will give you minus of 2 ac so this is negative sign 2 ac and third one is plus b square uh, bc negative sign and negative sign bc so this is minus of 2 bc and the last one is c square this is your answer basically but you can rearrange all these three into a better pattern which is a square rearrange all these if you want to otherwise this is your answer a square plus b square plus c square so all a square b square c square all taken together plus plus 2ab minus 2ac minus 2bc so this could be your answer again but even if uh, you are not uh, rearranging them then this will be this would be your final answer